Hi everyone and welcome back to Chess for Charity. In this video, I want to share a really cool puzzle with you. So it is white to play and win. So currently, you'll see that black has 32 bishops on the board, so clearly this does not come from a real game of chess, and white has one bishop, meaning that black is up 93 points of material here, which is insane. And your job is to see if you can find a way to win with the white bishop and king together. So it's going to have to be a collective effort because there's only two pieces on the board and this king is only going to run on light squares. So take a second, see if you want to pause the video and give it a try. It's quite fun to play with. The position will be in the description if you want to copy and paste it and put it on chess.com or Lee Chess or somewhere. But it's a lot of fun, so I'd recommend giving it a shot. While you're doing that, let me quickly encourage you to subscribe if you have not yet already. Half of the income that I earn in this channel goes directly to charity. So every like, every subscriber helps me out so much. Okay, so I should first tell you the computer is saying this is a draw, and I've had it sitting here for about, I don't know, 5-10 minutes, and it's not a draw. So I can show that by playing a computer, but also start by just talking about what to do. So let's first check the king. Now, the king is going to run, right? They have two choices. It doesn't really matter where they go. What you're going to do is use this bishop to block away these squares and gradually put them in a quadrant of the board, right? This would be a quadrant of the board. If I can grab, draw it quickly, there it is. So, okay, maybe something like this, right? I'm blocking these. I'm limiting them to two squares. Those two squares are backwards. So let's say they go here, right? The idea is that I'm going to continue to limit their squares and like I'm saying, the computer is showing this is a draw, so I'm just going to make some moves here. I don't have an engine that will help me. And you really can't do anything to prevent the piece from getting into play and allowing it to run away. Because I have this king here, but this bishop is kind of the key. So just as an example, the king has two squares. It doesn't really matter where it goes. Maybe something like this. You can play king c4. Now you're already kind of running out of some squares. Okay, now the engine is saying it's mate in four. So maybe somewhere along there, black made a big mistake. Or the engine just figured it out. So let's say they keep going back. The point is that I can use the king. Now look at this. The king is now blocking this square. And the bishop is hold, or holding, this one bishop is holding these two squares, is what I'm trying to say. So now I'm forcing the king back. Now what is this doing? check now the king has to run and look at this cool move here bishop d7 blocking this and this and of course the king is holding this one which means they have only one move and don't even need the king for this that's checkmate so there are a lot of ways that you can play this i'm going to play against the computer to show just the way that it can happen i'll look at both moves to see where it goes but let's give it a try. So let me see if I can go all the way back, all the way back, and play versus computer. So let's give it a second to load. So this is a 3200 rated computer. So let's start with the check. Let's see what the computer does. Okay, it does go up. So I like this move. I like to block this. Uh, let's run the king in. I wonder if I'm gonna make any fatal errors. So the king has to go here. I can check you, the king has to go here. I go there, king has to go back, that's mate. Bang. Okay, what if the king went the other way? So let me go back. What if I choose to play as black? Will it work? Oh, it does work. Okay. <laughs> I wasn't sure what to expect. Let's see. It seems like I could still do this here. Just don't stalemate them. Right? That's the one thing you got to watch out for. This would be stalemate. So I'm a little concerned. Now it's not a corner square, so that's a little different. Maybe I have to push it to the corner. Perhaps that's the point. So they have to run here. They have to run away. So something like this. They have to start running this way. Check. Go that way. Ah, see? Go here at stalemate. Play the other way. Let's go there. Hmm. Um, I think I can go here and it's the same thing, right? Check, block it, and mate. This is super cool. 
I really think it's a nice exercise to play with the bishop and see how you can coordinate to control some squares. I'd recommend giving it a shot. I can play one more, but I don't think it'll really help you. I'm going to try to play as the black pieces. I wonder if I can do that. So, what if I make a move, like a random move? Can I play as black? I don't think it lets me. Okay. That's okay. Either way, the point is the same. So, there, there. And I'm trying to blitz it out a little bit now. Now I want to see how fast I can do it. Because that sounds like fun to me. So, let's move the king. What do I do? How do I triangulate this? I want to get the king here so I can play bishop here. And I can't go king here. That would stalemate them. So, what if I make this move, and then this move, and then this move. Oh, I lost the, the thread there. The point is to go here. Okay. Now I'm good. So just don't stalemate the king. Oh, as I say that, I almost do it. Okay, so how do I not stalemate the king? It's funny, I just did it two seconds ago. Okay, there it is. There it is. This is mate. Different kind of mate. This is on the edge. Cool. So hopefully you got something out of this. I know it's a really weird puzzle, but I think it's super cool. If you enjoyed it, let me know. Try it on your own. See how many moves it takes you. This last one was 17 moves. I didn't count the others. See how fast you can do it and see if there's a most efficient route. That sounds pretty fun. But yeah, that is it for now. Thank you so much for watching. And until next time, bye.